it's been a while since I purchased any eagles or proof eagles, and I still haven't. Hey everyone, Silver Steeler here. And winning image photography. So what do you mean I didn't purchase these, yet I still have three proof eagles in front of me? And they weren't here last week. Why would that be? Because you traded for them. Traded with who? Talking bullion. Mm, that's right. And what did I give him? Um, you'll have to check his video to find out. That's right. To see what I gave him for what I've got here, check out Talking Bullion's video. What have I got? And like I said, it had been a while, a long while mm -hmm. since, well, I think I ordered two 2021 Eagles just so I could throw one in a dance go album, but I'm done with Eagles. Got the Monster Box and I got quite a few proof Eagles, but Talking Bullion had a few extra he was getting rid of and he wanted to know if I had any holes in my collection. And out of all the ones he had, I had three holes. I had a 1991 proof Eagle I did not have. So I went ahead and traded him for that one. Thank you very much, TB. And by the way, I'll say this now. That man knows how to package up a package. If you do a trade with Talking Bullion, he's going to do you right. I mean, this thing was sealed. It came in an armored truck. I mean, you name it. I mean, thing could have fallen off a 100-story building. would have been okay. take a blowtorch to it. <laughs> right? And be careful not to melt the silver. So the next one. 2001 and all these excellent condition and as you can see the coas were all included with them the boxes are in great shape and i think they did survive a hundred story fall from the building and still arrived in perfect shape they made it through the usps <laughs> same thing that in itself is a triumph anymore these days if you need to know that Check up top, you'll see one of my videos that I did about the United States Postal Service that, well, you'll have to watch it. Anyway, let's get to the last of the three that I traded with them. This one is a 2003. Very nice. This one almost has like some deep cam going on with it. Very, very nice. Or at least cameo. Well, they all should be proofs. Well, they are, but I think out of the three, that's the one I think that shined the best. Mm -hmm. It really did. All right, so what does this bring us up to our total? Well, that I don't know, but it just so happens to be the next stream that we are going to have, and we'll have some giveaways in it. We're going to go over our entire American Silver Eagle proof set, sets that I have, or you know, we'll even bring out the specialty ones like the 2012, the 2013, um, the Pride of Two Nations. Anything that is proof or specialized with the American Silver Eagle, we're going to do a stream out. We're going to get ourselves an inventory because even we don't know off the top of our heads how many we're missing. I know there's a few yet, but thanks to Talking Bullion, that number just went down by three. Yeah. So thank you, Talking Bullion. Thank Pre you. Appreciate the trade. Hopefully you like what you got. Like I said, check out his video and see what I traded him to get these. He got a deal. I got a deal. That's what a trade is all about. It's going to bring this one to a close. Remember to like, subscribe. And all those other good things. We'll see you on the next video. Bye, everyone.